Let's, Let's ride top five. This one is a this one's this one's a fun one for everyone out there who enjoys movies and women. Yeah, probably a lot of people. Yeah, it's probably ninety seven point three percent. Of straight males. That sounds about right. And we're of course talking about top five actresses. Top five let's ride top actresses. Top five female stars of the silver screen. And on my list of top five actresses, number five, Sigourney Weaver. Ooh, alright, alright. I like that one. Iconic catalog of movies including aliens, multiple alien movies. Those were good. Those Avatar, were good. one of the greatest movies of all time. That Avatar. is true. Best selling movies of all time. Best selling movies of all time. There you go. Highest grossing, if you will. Yes, there you go. That's yeah. all right, all right. I like it. I can get I can get jiggy with that. Ghostbusters? I mean, come on. Yeah, oh, man, that list is pretty nice. My uh my top my number five actually has a, a list similar to that. My number five is gonna have to be Maggie Smith. Mm-hmm. See, I knew you would look very puzzled, and that Who's is Maggie gonna be Smith. That's going to be Mrs. McGonagall from Harry Potter. Got you. Okay. All right. You know, she's also in uh, Downtown Abbey. Downtown Abbey. What about Sister Act? What is it about? 1992. She's in that? Yeah. Oh, wow. What about good old Hook? Mm. Original, you know, 91. Okay. We also got um, some bangers here. Yeah, what about lie. from uh, way back, uh, First Wives Club? Oh, wow. Have not seen that. Can't say that I've seen Death that. Death on the Nile, 1978. Right. The original Othello. I mean, come on, people. Yeah, I mean, hey. Nice pick. Nice Secret pick. Garden. Maggie Smith. There we go. You know, if you don't know, you, you, now you know. Now you know. All right. Maggie Smith, let's ride. Let's ride. My top five actresses. Number four, got to have my girl in there, Winona Ryder, coming Ooh, in at number four. I wanted to put her. I did. That's my girl. I did. Yeah. But I knew you were going to put her, and I didn't want to match you. And there's a connection with four and five. Winona Ryder also in Alien movies. Also. That is true. That is true. She is also in Stranger Things. It's one of the greatest series ever. So, yeah. yeah. Yes, yes. House right. of the Spirits. Come on. All right, all right. One of the greatest books of all time. Nice, nice. All right, all right. I can get jiggy. My number, my number four. You know, not, not. Uh, you know, you might, might call me crazy. I just, uh, I've just always, uh, you know, like to look to look at her. So, uh, Scarlett Johansson is definitely my number four. You know, she's a, uh, she's a superhero. So she is a uh, Black Widow. You know, mm-hmm. uh, actually getting her own movie or series, I believe. Black Widow. You know, um, she's also in Sing. I don't know if you've seen that movie. No. Dis- Disney movie. Oh, no. Di- Sing's not Disney, actually. Pixar? Think- Pixar is Disney. But I think Sing's its own shit. It's like oh. the little animals that sing. Right. Um, But, you know, like I said, not too many movies that are, you know, what you would call a blockbuster, but I just always, uh, always loved her, so. Nice. Right, solid she pick. Had- she had to be on my list. Solid pick. All right. My top five actresses. Number three. Our girl, we all love her. I know Natalie Portman, number three. Ooh. All right, and, all right. I don't know. The producers don't seem too happy about that one. Nah, the producers. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I, I misread that. Yeah, you know. I mean, Star Wars, Padme from Star Wars. Star you know, Wars. Thor, Jane Foster and Thor. Mm-hmm. You know, V for Vendetta. V for Vendetta. Yes. Badass character in V for yes, Vendetta. Yes, Black Swan. Badass. Ooh, yeah. Mars Attacks. Mars Attacks. I forgot that was her in Mars Attacks. Yes, That's you her did. Wow. That's crazy. Uh, what's, the, what's the other one? The, I'm sick the of the producers the, trying yeah, I mean, yeah, in, in these headphones. For real. Which was the way we could turn them down in the headphones. I know, I know, I know. Yeah, no, nah, I, I do yeah. love that pick. Natalie Portman. You said number three? Number three. Yep, top three. All right, all right. My number three... Um, actually going to be Drew Barrymore. Ooh. You know, she's a, pick. yeah, she's been in a, you know, many Adam Sandler movies. Yeah. Uh, E.T. E.T., one of the very few successful child and adult 
actors. Yes, actually, time, that is true. Sure. Firestarter, I believe, was the one she was in as a kid. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, fe- fever Pitch, Riding yeah. in Cars with Boys. Mm. I mean, she's done it all. Yep. Batman Forever. Yeah, that's Val Kilmer, baby. Yeah, Batman Forever. <laughs> wow, forgot about that one. I believe her name was like Sugar in that shit something or something. like that, yeah. Yeah, you know. She was the Riddler's, uh, yeah. the Riddler's little. You know, who was uh, Jim Carrey, actually. Side piece, if you will. And that was, uh, oh, Charlie's Angels. Charlie's Angels. Great action movie. Yeah, Drew Barrymore's Great list has, a, you know, a lot of uh, mm-hmm. Scream. Oh, really? Yep. Wow, I forgot about that. Yeah, yeah. So, you know. Very nice. Wide range. Very, very, very wide range. Movie there. All right. And uh, let me just give you right into my number two. My number one and two were very, very hard to decide between. But uh, number two is definitely going to be have to be my girl, J-Law. For those of you who don't know, that Ooh. would be Jennifer Lawrence. Jennifer Lawrence. You know, uh, Katniss Everdeen in Hunger Games. Uh oh, I don't know if you've seen the recent movie. Don't look up. I uh, haven't seen it yet. But yeah, it was. It was. Worth, it's worth watching. It's worth watching. Um, X Men. Yeah, she's an X Men. X Men. Uh, Raven. Silver I Linings Playbook. Best movie of all time. Yeah. Silver Linings Playbook. Nice. All right. So top five actresses of all time. Number two, Kathy Bates. Ooh. Ooh all right. All right. That's... And. Uh, Yes. Very wide range for my girl yeah, as well. I see you. You are sticking with, you know, a little uh, older actresses. What you would say? Hey, like yeah, you definitely opened up with one of the. I have to put one on there, and then the rest were. That might be the oldest person on this list so far. Who? Maggie Smith. Uh, probably. But she definitely probably has the most accolades out of this list, too, bit. Hey. So, accolades, let's ride. Fight. Maggie Smith, let's ride. Exactly. Well, let me just lead you right into it there. My top five actresses of all time. Number one, and keeping with a the theme, as you said, Meryl Streep. Ooh. Number one. Ooh. That is my girl. My girl. And my I, th- girl. I thought we were doing best Ooh. actresses, not m- most overrated. Oh my god. Talk about accolades. That's an Oscar winner, buddy. You better have some god dang respect, Put son. Respect Put some fire. respect on that shit, son. Alright. I mean, uh, alright. And who, what, uh, what movies does she have Oscars for? She has an Oscar for some movie which I don't really remember at this moment. But definitely one of them, one of the movies made ever. And you're and you're saying whatever this movie is, she is the reason that it has an Oscar. I mean, she won the Oscar for this movie as a lead, I believe. So I would say so. Yeah. All right. All right. All right. Well, I mean, uh, while our producers vet some stuff. Oh, was that multiple Oscars? Mo- oh, more than best. Oh. More than best dog. Yes. Oh my god. And then, like I said, That's make sure you go double check those movies and see who else. And like I said, make sure you go check all those movies. Hey, I'm just saying that's. Uh, that's a little bit of accolades right there. So I know she good. has a lot of for accolades. Sure. For sure. For sure. The Rock has many accolades. I don't think so. And I think we're talking about like movies made. No, that was. I don't think The Rock. And they, they showed they showed a picture the other day of it was literally four different pictures of The Rock, and it's like this is four different movies, and it just it's literally it's shit. like basically the same exact scene. He's hanging off a building or something. Yeah. What was that? Nine Golden Globe Awards. That's crazy. Yes, I know. I know. Wow. I don't a lot. Even know Nicholas that much, Nicholas really. Cage also has a lot of awards. I do not really think that is accurate. To be honest with you. I do not really think that is accurate. What? What you just said. What? Nicholas Cage? Nicholas Cage has a lot of awards? Uh, I don't think so. I mean, I don't know. Maybe a producer can check that, but I just don't think that's factually correct. Yeah. There's people all the time that are overrated. They just, they just. I mean, hey, there's overrated people. Yeah, you're right. 100%. But, uh, my, you know, my number one is easy. You know, as, uh, she was on your list. And, uh, Natalie Portman. Nice. Number one. Solid pick. 
you know. Tom always got to yeah. love her. You know, not only is she an amazing actress, she can also rap. Yes. That's one of the greatest uh, celebrity raps of all time. All right, and I think that's all the time we have. This was a good spicy one for you guys. Nice. Very good. Very good. Very all right, good. well, uh, until next time, this has been Let's, Let's Ride Top 5. five.